Well, not quite all. Okay. Good bad time. Heavy on the iron. Well, what's it like? You've had a week just to get ready for this thing now that it's finally here. The maybe comparisons of starting at home, being on the road here tonight for round two. It's different it's for a group that had a bunch of players not having any playoff experience. You know, we go into Minnesota and get, get that out of the way. That idea of the first uh, the first game on the road, real loud building in Minnesota, we expect the same. So it's not the same kind of newness uh, for our guys, but uh, certainly there's been the excitement all week. And I'm sure both teams have felt. And then after about the third practice, there was it had enough practice and I wanted to get going. So we're, we're both I'm sure both teams are even in Florida. If Sherrod were to play tonight, what could style-wise, and just what would be added to your whole life? Joe Morrow and Ben Sherrod played for the important roles for us. Um, this year, different style of player, but both equally effective. Uh, moved the puck simply. Joe's uh, created some offense for us, and Ben's been a real important penalty killer and a good physical player on the walls. Paul, how do you think your players handle being away from game action for weeks. Yeah, I think well, but I'm sure Pete DeVore felt the same way, right? You, you know, always worry about those things. The, the time on ice, uh, the intensity level was good, um, but that's been the way we've practiced all year. So there, there wasn't a departure because it was round two. Nothing changed for us right down to the drills, right? We ran a couple of different things on different schemes and other than that, the drills were the same, the length was the same. Profanity was the same, and nothing changed for us. So uh, we wanted to keep that, um, you know, that routine that we've talked about so much all year. It was, it was